people perceive me as a fashion icon, I would say so myself. Some would say I'm rich just by my fits on IG. But I'll say it once more. I'm not rich. I just thrift. What's going on, y'all? Peace and love to y'all. Y'all really need a, you know what I mean? Y'all know what we doing today. Now look, I probably wanna, bro, these damn rubber bands in my head keep coming out. I wanna go for something different today. I wanna try some like, flashy. You know what I mean? Y'all know what we here to do. Y'all know what we come here to do. Y'all know what we usually do. And plus I'm keeping it on the calm too. Cause I told you I already got something for y'all for 100K subs. So since I got something cooking for y'all for 100K subs, we gonna keep it on the calm, you feel me? So. Hey, I feel about this. What, Disney? Hell nah. We gonna go straight to the jacket. See, look. Key already over there with the cardigans in drawing. What's going on, y'all? I know I look a little different. Took the braids out. Got a cut by Mari, man. Yeah, look nice. We about to see what they talking about. Mari. Yes, I love Mari. M A R I. Yes, ma'am. Uh huh. It's on Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, you know what I'm saying? Whatever you like. I do that too. I do that too. Like, I do different things when I come thrifting. Yeah, they get it all. They get it all. Okay, now look. We in this section. Last time, if y'all watched the blindfold, I looked at this and I was like, ooh. Okay. Now, now that I'm looking at it for real, that's like a little longer than I expected. These rubber bands keep popping out my head, bro. I'm about to take them out. I'd rather start shopping for the winter and stuff like when it get cold. I'd rather start shopping for that stuff now. So, yeah. For those who go thrifting and stuff now, don't go thrifting looking for no shorts or nothing like that, bro. All that about to go out of style real soon, bro. Not really out of style, but like out of season. Y'all style for the season, how y'all feel about it? I don't wanna be in your style. No, you good. You want these socks? Look at these socks. They're good, then. I don't know if you wear long socks. I do. I'll tell you. Where you find these at? You're not on there. <laughs> yeah. You can. On Instagram? It's no spaces. no spaces. Yes, ma'am. It's a cinema camera. It's not like a vlogger. It's like people make movies and stuff on it. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. I'll give you my socks. Show me. Okay. <laughs> my other one. Oh, here's the guy that was filming you in the parking lot. I saw. Uh huh. That's him. That's yeah. my homeboy. Oh, he's here. Yeah. So how hard is it to do all of this? Just well, um, it's it's a it's a whole process. Well, if y'all see my content, y'all would see like, cause I do film. Yeah. So are we back in business? Saying track and field. Damn. If this ain't had the track and field on, I like. It. I like it, we got track and field. Okay, we ball. These are the fundamentals I look for when I thrift for, for hoodies, um, and like long sleeve shirts. So with this hoodie right here, the reason I like it is because the sleeves is wide. Um, my arms aren't huge or that big, so I like that bigger look, that baggier look. And then the wrist, it cuts short so that it'll have that perfect crop. See these right here? These don't cut too short, you know what I'm saying? You see it's a little bit loose, but it's okay. But this right here, this cut tight, so I know to fit on my wrist perfectly. You know what I'm saying? I can throw on a watch, my watch will pop out. I like it, and plus I don't got no yellow hoodie, so I'm gonna throw that in the bag, I'm gonna get that. I just met those, uh, those ladies, and um, they was talking about how they want to start content and, and, and vlog and stuff like that. Um, but they feel like they too old. Y'all, it ain't no age to this. Like, like, it ain't no age to it at all. Like, YouTube content creation is for everybody. Like, you ain't never too old. If you start thinking like that, like, you might think like, oh, you too old. Like, it's too late for you to do stuff like this, bro. 
And that's how you miss out on the best things in life. When you start convincing yourself, you too old for this, or oh, let me leave it, you know what I'm saying, to the, the millennials and stuff like that. Like, let me leave it to them. You're going to miss out on blessings and opportunities. Like, it's people out there. You, you got to think, like, it's a whole world out here. And I was just talking about this on Instagram. Like, this dude, this one dude on IG, he responded to my story. And he was like, yo, Mari, I get, like, 400 views on my IG, but I only got 70 subscribers. And he kind of losing, like, motivation. You know what I mean? Like, how that's supposed to work? And I was telling him, you can't depend on... The people around you or the area or the people that, that know you or your followers on IG, once again, YouTube is its own platform. Like, and that's the same, that's crazy because that's the same thing I first did when I started YouTube. I used to post on IG, y'all go watch my vid, right? And I get like a thousand views on IG at the time. And only like, only 100 people watch my vid and give or take. Maybe that was for IG, maybe that wasn't from IG, but all y'all watch my, you know what I'm saying? Y'all say y'all, y'all say y'all, y'all f me this and that, woo 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 but ain't none of y'all watch my vids. And that's when I took the time to to start posting on YouTube and I stopped reposting my my uploads on IG, telling them, I stopped telling them to start, to start watching my videos. Like I stopped telling them that. And the reason why I did is was because they had to realize that YouTube was its own platform. When I realized that, I was like, okay, I'm not gonna post on anything else, and I want to gain organic uh, subscribers and organic supporters. That way, I would never have to repost on IG because these organic subscribers are waiting for me to post. They're gonna watch me every single time. If I keep me posting on IG, they're gonna click a video that seems interesting to them. They ain't gonna click every single video. They only gonna watch when you tell them to watch. But by gaining organic subscribers, they gonna watch every time you post because they found you through the algorithm and they're subscribing because they actually are fucking with you. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's some words of encouragement to y'all out there, man. It's a whole world out here who are here to support you and who can watch you. Don't depend on the area around you at all. At all. Don't depend on the area around you to support you. Because nine times out of ten, the people who, who know you or f with you, a stranger will support you before your own folks who know you. Like, your own folks who claim they support you, a stranger will support you before them and show more love before them. So, you know what I mean? It's people out here who appreciate you way more. So, don't settle down and don't determine your success based off what? Based off because people around you ain't showing no love, man. There's plenty of love out here, man. Come get you some, bro. Just keep on posting. You're going to reach your audience, period. And I go for content, YouTube, music, fashion, clothing brands, makeup, everything. You know what I mean? Y'all expect the people y'all love to support you, man. Them niggas don't got to support you. They don't got to support you. And it ain't hate at the end of the day. You know what I mean? Like, some people just don't see the vision in the beginning. But you got to make them see that vision. You know what I mean? Like, a lot of folks don't see the vision in my work before. Like... You know what I mean? It was a lot of people who ain't want to come up, pop out to my videos, you know what I mean? Like, in the beginning. Ain't nobody want to pop up to my videos because they just ain't see the vision there. It's kind of nice. It's small, though, like, yeah. A lot of people ain't want to pop out to my, you know what I'm saying? My meetings or my gatherings and be a part of my video just because they ain't see the vision there. But, you know what I mean? They'll pop out now, you know what I mean? They want to be part of videos now. And that's just how it is. You just got to make people see the vision. Not gonna lie, I probably skipped on on a lot of stuff just by talking to y'all. You know what I mean? It's getting close to that turtleneck time, bro. We find anything? Honestly, now nah, they hating on me today. They ain't got my size right now, but I found like tops. I like that. It goes some slacks, nice little chain, black slacks. Uh, arms gonna be tight. No, I want that look. I want that look. All right. I got dress look. Some gray jeans. That's like mid tone my size. I can wear them low. It's look like high waters. Nah, nah, they ain't high one. You bitches don't look your length, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. <laughs> you bitches look bro, okay. small. Bro, okay, but we're here. I'm trying to judge my No, I'm saying, I'm, I'm telling you. They do look small, though, but. They look small. I don't know. I just, I just threw it in there because I seen that was my first look. Bro, 
Man, yo, I tweaking, boy. They hate on me today. What you put up on Hell nah. You supposed to be leveling up, boy. Yo, I leveling bro, I, down. Bro, here you go. See, I was talking to them. I already told them. Yeah, yo, I got patched, bro. Patched by her. Right here. Nigga patched his ass. What is yellow? I like the yellow. It's clean. Let me get it, bitch. Oh, oh, my shit. You're not doing that. I'm so Watch me get that shit. Watch me get it. The only reason why he's saying that is because he ain't get this. Last time he went through it, because he ain't get it. You see that? You see that thing he got? I was supposed to get that hoodie. I was supposed to get that hoodie. He grabbed it at my buggy. He grabbed it at my buggy. So now he want this? You're not getting it. Not getting it. Oh! Look at that dumb ass thing right there. Yo, stop following me, nigga. You're a cheek holder. You gonna pack a black tees? No, 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 that's not black tees. Uh, lady came by. It's it a pack of black socks, long socks. And they five five dollars, bro. You ain't getting it. Oh, money, man. I'm, uh, I'm gonna pick this up for you, man. Nah. <laughs> Nigga, a hoe. I didn't know if I, if if I should get it or not. Get it? Cause I don't have I don't have uh green. Let me see. If you if you told me get it, why you putting in your buggy? Why you putting in your buggy? Let me see it. Yeah, I think I should get this, y'all. But it's like, nigga, what? 12 Rattlers. What is this, bruh? The coat, nigga? Yo, pull it up, bruh. Hold on, bruh. Uh, what you feel about this? I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna touch that. I don't know. Just, okay, okay. Might get this because I don't got that color bus. This is good leather. Y'all, this is good leather. It's real good leather. I might put that in there. I ain't gonna lie to you, I really don't need no more leather, if you're being real. Ooh. Why the shoulders cut down like this, though? See, look, it's nice, because it's all black, and it's, you know what I mean? I don't got an all black one. But why the hell the shoulders cut down like that, bro? Look at that. Y'all <laughs> Bro, they got shoulder pads. This is, it's, it's nice, but like, you see the shoulders? Hmm. You feel like it's going like. That's a nice piece though. You, but why the shoulders? Why you don't like, like what's, what's the purpose? Look at the shoulders, like, look how the shoulders like slim down. Like, look at that, it really like shoulder pads. Like, do you think it's gonna look bad? It's not gonna look bad, cause some, some look terrible, I'm not gonna lie. And I found this leather right here. It's some good ass leather, feel it. That's not like some. Okay. It's some it looking kill. <laughs> I showed you that right here. Even though it say track field, I still like. I'm like, yeah. hey, who cares? It's yellow though. Yellow, yellow color. Yeah, you know I mean, I might put it back. I ain't gonna lie. Oh hell nah, yeah. I need to see the back on it, bro. I'm putting it down. And this John too, like, I might put this down too. What time is it? Oh, we found some a couple good stuff. Get that slip back, nigga. <laughs> Ooh, we. Ooh, nigga, be pimping. Nigga said, man, I go to work. My cat daddy. Ooh. This is nice. This is nice. This is nice. Oh my goodness, look at that. This is nice. This is nice. That's a cop. Now I ain't gonna do no DIY. You know what I mean? I got something to do later on. So unfortunately I can't do no DIY. So we ain't gonna do it. This is really nice. Why am I finding all these like... Vintage drawings. This is nice too. It's just like if the body part was like more bulky and not straight down, it'd fit better. Are you doing a YouTube video? Yes, sir. 
Look at this John I found right here. This John vintage as hell. Look at it. Ooh, wee. Quality. Pieces. Beautiful. So far, like, ever since I've been here, niggas been going through tops. We're gonna try to find some, some bottoms. I'm obsessed with the blues. I can't get enough of the blues. I mean, let me see what they talking about. They put some American, American Eagle. They too small. It's tissue. What's the issue? I don't like my jeans feeling tight on me. I like them. I like a bigger fit. You know what I mean, but you know what I'm saying the waist not too big, but just a stockier fit. Hold up. Kind of like these. I'm gonna slick if I'm being, if I'm being real. Only because of the stitching. I like them because of the stitching. The waist won't be too big. I'm gonna I'm add them. I'm gonna add them to that. I like these too, but I can't fit them. The waist too big for me. I'm gonna see if Key like them. I'm gonna come back to the funnels too. You know what I mean. I need more flannels. I ain't wanna start off with the flannels though. I wanna start off with the tees. Yo, this shirt is slick, short as hell, but it'll probably stop at the perfect length. I might add that there. <laughs> I might add it. And cause the shoulder line don't stop like right here. You got this little piece which extends the shoulder part so it won't be too short on me. And it stops like really short. So I might add this. Do you like these? It's for you. You can you probably, I'm, I wanna see if you can fit these. Cause I can't fit them. I wanna see if you can fit them. And I know you need some like denim too. That's, hey, that's if you can fit them, buddy. Check the uh, the uh, waist. So can, can you fit them? I ain't been trying them right now, but I know. You think you can fit them? I, I like them. I like them, you know what I mean? Yeah, you, you can be right there. Let me up. Yeah, I know how it goes. Only found one pair of pants. I want some black ones though. I don't really like skinny jeans, yeah. I don't really like these because they cut, you know what I'm saying, tight at the bottom. I don't like skinny jeans, I don't. You know what I mean? I just don't like that look. I can use some jeans like this too, you know what I mean? They're a little bit baggier. I want different shades of jeans. Mm, bro. I love baby blues. I don't need like these classic denim. I steady wearing baby blue jeans. Y'all probably be thinking I be wearing the same pair. Hell no, nah. I got a lot. Mm. Hell no, nah, boy. Nigga be, nigga be slap boxing the knees in the bathroom, bro. One thing I love doing, I love challenging myself. And it's like, you never really know. You would never really know if you're ready or when you're ready. You just gotta go. You just gotta run. It will never be a time when you're actually ready or fully prepared for something. You will never be ready. And that's that's how I'm living my life right now. I'm just running. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. You know what I mean? I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. I'm just running. If it's something I feel like I can't do, I'm gonna do it. Just because, you know what I'm saying, I had that, that thought in my head saying I can't do it. So I'm already challenged myself to do it. And I haven't failed to do it. Now everything I make is not perfect, no. Everything you make won't ever be perfect or won't ever be the best. It don't have to be good. The bad is beautiful too. Just like the good, you just gotta fall in love with the process. Once you fall in love with the process, man, you will see results, period. And I go with anything you will see results. But uh, yeah, I got a lot of plans for y'all. Got a lot of plans for y'all. So I can't wait for y'all to experience with me. If I can't find another pair of pants, I'm gonna just go straight to the uh, finals. Sheesh. Those who need some type of guidance or somewhere to start when you go thrifting, you go thrifting, look for a nice pair of jeans. And I'm not talking about these, you know what I mean? Or these i'm talking about a nice actual denim a nice denim you know what i'm saying get you some nice denim some thick fabric not no no 
no stretchy no stretchy john you don't want no stretchy john get you some nice thick fabric and start off with get you some baby blues you know what i mean and try you different shades you can do what you want you need to listen to me that ain't no funnel and then cotton you know what i mean that's like a dress shirt you want that cotton feel Like this right here, I mean, it's kind of slick. That's more so like a cotton feel. I'm looking for a good pattern flannel. Mm. That's that's kind of nice. This is nice. You, you said what? Next time I come back, and next time I go through, I'm gonna look for a book. Go to the damn library if you want to look for a book. Yeah, they got it, bro. This is nice, y'all. I'm gonna go. You know, Why you ain't see this? I ain't see it. I was gonna scan back through. This would be nice. You want it? Remind me. Psych, nigga. You thought it was, boy. <laughs> I I'm only training you yeah. for that yellow flannel. If you want this, would y'all trade this for the yellow flannel? This is nice. And you crop this drawing too. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. What you trying to do? Hold up. You don't like it no more, huh? The buttons is killing me. The butt is killing me, y'all. Uh. You gotta get past that, then. Judy B. Jones has button. There you go. You gotta get past that. <laughs> he crying because y'all ain't like the video yet. <laughs> like the video. See, he stopped crying. Look. If you think about it like that, then you don't want this shit, nigga. Uh. Look, they can try to downgrade. You trying to have both. Woo! You can have both, man. You know why he can have both? Because I'm going to give out blessings. You know why? The blessing can come right back to me. You know what I mean? So I ain't tripping. Like the video. You know what I mean? That's the one I picked up, too. And I was like, that's nice. I get it. If I like, I like, hey, you know what I mean? Nah, you can have it. It's nice. It's really nice. Wait, let me do my gritty. Hey, hold on, hold on. Am I doing it? How much items you got? I got jeans. I'm about to run through. I'm going to run through all these right here. I'm going to run through all these. See what I like and don't like. And yeah, you know how it go, man. Process of elimination, baby. After you gather a lot of stuff at a thrift store, or your local Goodwill or whatever you shop at, you wanna do a process of elimination right after, right? So that's exactly what we about to do. When I started rap, they used to laugh at me. AMG, I'm laughing in the backseat. A god, what this shit, my flow too classy. Yeah, I remember you, shorty, and you passed me. Now they wanna smash me, they don't wanna pass me. Man, that whole in Mexico, for that whole I last week. Say, ain't you this, ain't you that? I'm too flashy, say, ain't hey, you this, ain't hey, you that I'm too flashy, yo, ay, I'm flashy, yo
Yeah, I can I'm going to check this out. Oh, I have a music video to film. Like, what time is it? Damn! 30, 40 minutes went by? We got a dip. I got a music video to film. So, uh, I'm gonna get back to y'all. When I get back to y'all, man. If I come and sit down right here, and you come like basically this way from that sky shot, well, it's gonna be different shots, like you say, but sky shot, and it comes into my face right here while I'm sitting down. I look at you and I start rapping that first part. Damn, this trail closed off. Um, this is better right here. This would be better. I ain't gonna lie. It's most space right here. And so, like, so where I was necessarily sit at. Do you want to sit or you want to stand? I feel like sitting down will give more of a like a popping feature. You feel me? Especially to the first part. Mm hmm And like how like it comes from the beauty to the sky to me exploring locations of myself that was sun okay. and it's more slow. Alright, let's run it. Okay. Let's just let's just run it. That's wraps of the uh, music video. For sure, for sure. Got it done. I had to get this real quick. Look at this guy, y'all. Oh. Sheesh. That is beautiful. I had to get it. Um, my camera about to die now, but dropping Sunday. More to come, more to come. Divine, divine. Y'all hear him, man. Y'all hear him. All right, so we're going to go ahead and wrap this up. I'm almost busting my ass on this damn trail. I'm not going to lie. I should have brought my camera charger. You got anything else planned, Jawa? Nah, that's it, man. Yeah. I like, you really carried. <laughs> huh? I said, you really carried. I mean, that's my job. All you, you know what I'm saying? You bring me the song. You know what I mean? And I create. Look at that, y'all. You bring me the song and I create, my guy. It's all love, bro. It's all love, bro. I appreciate it. Thank you, bro. No problem, man. I gotta go swimming here. I wanted to go on like a swim date. In this water? Yes. Nah. No, swim, yeah. fish. Yeah, fish. Shit. <laughs> like, nah, nah, wait, not easy. swim. I mean, fishing. I want to go on a, a fish day. Nah, but that would, that would be cool. Though. Hell yeah. Y'all know me. Oh, we getting a camera stay made. My bad, my bad. Let me wipe you off. Come and get you some. Come and get you some, baby. I'm on five percent. So here is how it's gonna go. That's the end of this video, man. Talk. I got a question. We not eating wings like with a combo, right? Do you eat the wing first and then you eat the fries? To me, I open it. I do a little test. I test the fry. You know what I mean, I get a little fry test. I thought I do a little tester. Then I eat the wing. You know what I mean. Tell me why this man worked his way backwards. This nigga ate all his fries, ate all his celery, and then left the wings for last. That's the only way to do it. That's the right way to do it. I ain't the right way. You know what? Psycho. Y'all coming down below how y'all eat y'all. Y'all uh, y'all combo, man. Y'all start with the wings, man. As you can see, there's no bed on the table. I don't know if it look like a drink because it's going to take away my appetite. Get the Man, you want to rejoice. Fuck a bath. Bye, have a great time.